energy vibration reading for the Libra Sun Moon Horizon sign I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back this is uh, wonderful whatever is transpiring and whatever is happening um, for you guys this is the third week the week is an air week all over just the energy vibration is here so their energy is here Monday and Tuesday Tuesday it changes to um, emotional okay but there is stability that is here there is definitely stability that is here so we are going to be looking and seeing what exactly is happening for you birds okay so um as we look on Monday there is the energy of the lovers so you could be dealing with siblings family that sort of a situation but this is more of lovers and um, your kids and your, your parent lovers and your kids okay there's help that is going to be coming in the seven of Pentacles is here um, where a project a situation with a project or something that is going on the energy of the elephant is here whatever the situation with the energy of the elephant you're dealing with an organization um, the ten of Pentacles financial stability come in for some of you guys and the energy of the world and um, this can be victory and success but I'm not seeing what is transpired so it's not really um, it could be that you have overcome a situation okay you have overcome a situation so whatever does it whatever it that is playing is that you're standing your grounds and you could be overcoming a situation in this week that has to do with the organization and what has transpired okay so you could be getting out of a situation that someone got you in so you know good for you whatever is transpiring someone could have gotten you in a situation and you're speaking the truth and you are coming to getting out of this situation now the energy of the lover is here let's see what is happening some of you have to this has to do with work some of you feel as if I've worked so hard in this relationship I'm so tired I don't know what else to do um, it could be a situation with some of you that are married or is in a relationship or you're trying to bring stability in this relationship but there is so much it's as if you are so tired you're definitely tired of uh, um, you know you've been trying to work on the situation it's not happening it's not working out and you're deciding to leave this relationship behind okay so you liberals decide that hey um, yeah um, whatever is happening I am NOT getting out of this I don't know I've tried everything um, some of you it could be um, your husband or wife is sick and you're so tired because you're working you're coming home you're helping them out that sort of a thing that you can have in this week now the level the lovers and the seven of Pentacles the seven of Pentacles is here twice so it's all about you working on something it's, it could be working on yourself this week it could be working on our with others it can be your home business but you're constantly and if it's your own business it's going to bring you success here it's going to bring you financial success if it's your home business it's definitely going to bring you some financial success so um, calling out from the angels and guides to tell us what is here with the lovers and the seven of Pentacles the lovers and the seven of Pentacles Oh, this is so wonderful so that was what I was saying in the beginning is that you are going to be working out you know this could be I'm getting in that some of you your partner is sick and you're helping them out and you're being there for them through thick and thin true love and this is going to be good because it's going to be paying off it's definitely going to be paying off okay um, some of you are in a, um, a marriage or a relationship that uh, wow it it is you have been trying with this relationship but at the end of the day you have so much love the love that you have um, is so powerful and you don't want to let go of this relationship the love that you have is so powerful so keep going on it because um, it's going to pay off in the long run okay now the six of Pentacles is here what is that saying for the liberals in this week the six of Pentacles it has to do with uh, making a decision okay and uh, you made a decision and help is going to be coming in once you made the decision and said hey universe I want to move I really want to move from this place I 
I think that this place is um, have been here enough. I can't deal with this situation anymore. I really want to move from this place. The universe is going to bring in help for you. And this is what is happening is that you want to make a decision to get away from something and but you don't have the financial um, backative and you're going to be receiving it you're definitely going to be receiving it okay um, you are going to be seen um, right now you're not seeing the way out yet but it's as if as you talk to the universe and said the universe I have been here for a very long time I need to move I need to do this I need to do that the universe you're not seeing where you're going but it it's going to be happening for you it's as if as you speak and ask for what you want the universe is going to be opening up a door for you okay seven of Pentacles with business what is the same because obviously people were working on project definitely um, people who are um, working with a family to heal a situation this is definitely going to be happening so it's all about the family in the week it's about the people who are married um, and in relationship that you're working on something keep on working on it because love is going to be coming in and here the family is going to return to its normal sense so just go ahead 10 um, so you guys have the energy of 10 twice and 7 so 7 and number 10 the organization what is the situation here with the family and the organization obviously some of you um, uh, you could be dealing with child custody because there's an organization watching you and the family you could be dealing with child custody because the organization is watching you and the family whatever that has to inspire an organization is definitely watching you and the family okay the organization is looking at your financial stability they're watching you and the family whatever is transpiring uh, yeah and the energy of the devil is now in reverse and whatever that was playing there was some lies and deception about you and your family and an organization was watching you and they're seeing that you know whatever lies was told is not true whatever lies that was told, it's not true so that is good the Ten of Pentacles is here. Financial stability is going to be coming back to your family because money is going to be coming in. Definitely, definitely money is going to be coming in. So financial stability is definitely going to be coming back. Um, some of you are going to be receiving help from um, a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person. Okay, so a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person is definitely going to be coming in. Um, whether it's a man or a woman, they're going to be helping you out. Okay, a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person is going to be coming in, and they're definitely going to be um, helping you out in situations. Okay, so a lot of earth people, a lot of um, money is in this week for you, Librans. Unexpected, a lot of money is in for you. The energy of the world is here. Let's see what's happening. There's definitely an ending. Your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true your wishes and dreams so if you were wishing that your relationship change if you're wishing that your husband or wife whatever the situation is that it returned to normal it is you were just going through a dry spell all relationships a dry spell if you have a situation with your family that it wasn't good all the relationship it has a dry style it's going to come back the family is going to be um, a re return uh, to normal okay but be aware um, of what is happening the ace of swords is here what is happening what is happening the ace of swords now you're going to be speaking and some of you were dealing with and Aries Lee or a Sagittarius person and you're going to be speaking and standing up to this person this person could be your mom and you're just communicating with your mom you know this person could be your mom and you're telling your mom how you feel about the situation and you know spilling your guts to this person let this person know exactly how you felt about a situation and this is there and you know your mom is going to be helping you or someone could be helping you to bring financial stability and balance in your world you're going to be letting your mom know how you're you know how the burdens that you're carrying you're going to be opening up to your mom and let your mom know the burdens that you're carrying and by doing that help 
Um, and sometimes it is good to talk to you know, like your parents instead of talking to your sisters or a brother or a, a girlfriend. It is good to talk to your parents, your mom, and that sort of a thing because you know whenever you speak to your mom, you're understanding that this is going to be staying where it is. But for some of you, um, a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn is really going to be coming in your life and is going to be helping you out of your financial stability. Whether it's a man or a, or a woman, this woman is really going to be coming in and help you out. You are protecting yourself from a situation. What is that? The, the Empress. The Empress. And the Empress could be a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Whoever this person is, it could be someone in power. It's coming from an, out of an organization. It's as if this lady, some of you could be on their supervision from um, child custody or something. If there was a situation that has happened in your house, whatever the situation is that has happened in your house, um, it's, it's as if you're on the supervision. It's as if they're they're watching you and, and having you on the supervision. Whatever the situation is, definitely I'm seeing that they're watching and having you on the supervision. Be careful, because here is it. Um, whoever is in this organization, they could be developing and being enemies to you. So be careful about this, okay? Now, um, whatever that is transpiring, you're definitely seeing that, you know, working because you have been working hard on your marriage or your relationship and um, also working hard on your family because this is definitely marriage and relationship. This side is family. It's not really business. It can be business if some of you have business, but it is basically the family because um, the Ten of Cups is the energy of the family and you trying to work and make sure that your family is okay there was some deceptive or there was something that happened in your house that is as if an organization is watching okay so something has happened in your house and it's as if an organization is watching so whatever this is or this was it's as if something had happened in your house an organization is watching you okay so all right let's see what is coming out for you Librans. And always for a personalized reading, you can always ask for a personalized reading. We have two cards, card one, card two. What's happening with card one? Blessings are going to be coming in. This is one of the most beautiful cards of this deck. So again, you can see this blessing coming in from the universe, the Ace of Cups. Remember, seven and ten, Ace of Pentacles, nine of pen, ten of Pentacles. So this is good. So some blessings are going to be coming in for you this week in love and um, newness. Um, your wishes and dreams are going to be coming through. So it's I expect unexpected blessings and peace for card two. If you choose card two, um, this is going to be a very, very good week for you guys. A very wonderful, very peaceful. Peace comes to the family um, towards whatever is happening. Definitely a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn is going to be coming in to help you balance out your financial situation. Peace is going to be coming in. Some of you could have had a situation against an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. This could be a friend or something. Communication is going to be the key, and you're going to be releasing this burden. Okay, wonderful. Have a wonderful week, and I'm wishing you guys a wonderful, positive week. Um, bye.